Hi, this is Phil Hinton and welcome to another video here on AV Forums. Today we're in Berlin with Louvre. I'm looking at three new TVs and some audio products. So let's catch up with CTO Thomas and find out a bit more about the products we've seen today here in Berlin. Well, welcome to Berlin. So um, we have a lot of new products with us. So um, in the couple of next two months, we are introducing 24 new products. So we are introducing three new TV lines. So we have the VC OLED, the OLED product for the premium entry. Then we have in the middle range, we have the Lube Inspire. This is the all-round TV, let me say, which is um, on a module basis. So the customer can select speaker um, 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 bar, he can select um, um, different different um, um, uh, setup solutions, for example. And we have the flagship, the, the, the top luxury um, flagship um, premium um, TV line, which is the Louvre Stellar. And from the Louvre Stellar, we have um, a very unique and special concept. This is, by the way, from the sizes from 42 inch till in the end of this year, beginning of next year, till 97 inch. And we have the own display module production running in Germany, in our factory, in our headquarter in Bavaria. Yeah. So, and this enables us that we have a consistent design language, which is also a an, an brand um, and, a, and, a, and, a, and a DNA, a Löwe DNA aspect, um, enables us a consistent, a consistent design language from small sizes to the big sizes. So every TV looks the same, has the same valuable materials, has, for example, a brushed aluminum frame. And uh, in, this, in this setup, we have a, con a real concrete um, backplate, yeah. which is called the bottom chassis <laughs> in, our, mm -hmm. in our internal language. Um, this is real concrete material, handcrafted. I, I want to ask you the question that, that sometimes gets thrown at, at Lover and other luxury brands, and that is that, well, it's just a rebadged LG or whatever. But that's yeah. not the case, because what you're talking about here is the glass comes from LG Display, yeah. but everything else you do, image processing, everything else is your own. Everything is ours, yes, exactly. So for sure, the glass, we need to, where we have a very long-term uh, long cooperation with our partner, LG Display. So the glass, the open cell, for sure, we cannot do by ourselves. We select them. It's a, a, a great A-plus um, a glass. And we integrate them into our own engineered and designed and engineered display module. So this is unique. It's not existing um, in Europe anymore. Such kind of um, added value in the vertical uh, level. So um, there, is, there are cer certain advantages, not only for us, also for the customer. Because the customer, for example, gets always the latest panel technology. He gets always the newest, like we have it with 55, 65, 77, for example, like the newest Meta MLA technology, which has peak luminances even up to 3,000 nits. For sure, we are not going in that crazy way because we are we are standing for sustainability, for long lifetime, long mm -hmm. long life cycle. Yeah. So we limit this with 2,000 nits, which is even double than the previous generation. So um, from the from the heart of the TV, there is an, an, a powerful SOC inside, which enables 2.1 HDMI on 144 hertz on all channels. So we have the perfect gaming TV in a combination with perfect streaming TV because we have the world leading operating system um, in, a, in a cooperation with Samsung Tyson. So they have an, we have a partnership for an exclusive um, 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 premium Tyson operating system yeah. which is called Luve OS 9. And this enables us a global content accessibility. So beside um, um, smart home integration and all the other things. So we have a powerful platform in a combination with a powerful display technology and a unique and outstanding design. So this is the perfect match for the luxury and the premium TV market. Um, from the technology point of view, um, for the Stellar, we are also opening or writing a new chapter with this open cell integration business that we can um, use um, 
um, uh, new technologies in a faster way because mm. we are not depending on a display module, which is which needs to be aligned with many customers in the in the in, in, in the world, which are using the same foundation from the display module. No, we are use, we are integrating the open cell, the, the class, and that's why we can use always the newest technology in a faster way. Yeah. yeah. So let's talk about yeah, the the OLED panel, and OLED panel mm -hmm. um, production, and so on. So we are talking about second generation Meta uh, in the Stellar. So yeah. maybe tell the audience a little bit about what you're doing there. So generally, the difference between Meta and standard OLED is that there is an um, an, an, an certain film applied, which um, consists out of billions of lenses. Yeah. So this is necessary, or this is used for decreasing the, the light losses inside the, the display. So it's like a light recovery and increasing even more than it was with the OLED, uh, the viewing angle. So you, if you compare Meta with uh, standard OLED, you will clearly see there is higher brightness level because you have more efficiency, um, up to um, peak luminance, theoretically till 3000 nits. We limit this to 2000 nits. Yeah. On a 100% um, white level, we have 250 nits, which is also, in comparison to the standard OLED, 100 nits more. Yeah. And, and even the viewing angle is getting better with the meter. So it's, it's the perfect technology for, um, yeah, for the premium luxury products. So Thomas, I just want to ask a quick question about the concrete on the back of the TV. Mm. Now, it's a great marketing thing. But in terms of practicality, people are going to be thinking concrete, that's going to weigh a lot and what's the benefits of it? Yeah, so, yeah. so maybe explain that the idea and the philosophy behind this. Yeah, so from the philosophy or from the idea behind, um, for sure we want to use something which is unique, which is others, which are others not using. So in terms of material combination. And yeah, you, 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 you might remember the uh, iconic story from last year. This yeah. was the TV made out of stone. And this was the, the inspiration a little bit for us to think about, yeah, surface, okay, made out of stone and, and concrete is also on vogue. It's a, it's a trend for being clean and, and having um, 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 yeah, an, 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 an unique surface. Mm. And uh, this surface, so the, the, the rear, um, the back um, cabinet of the TV, this is a handcrafted concrete material. And don't worry about the weight, it's, it's not so thick, so there's a, an, 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 an aluminum carrier, which is uh, glued with a two millimeter concrete surface. So this is handmade, yeah. and it's not so not so heavy. It's for sure some maybe some one or two kilograms, but not so much. Yeah. So don't worry about the weight too much. It's for sure also depending on the size. Um, but the story is being different, being different, showing um, that Löwe can do not only standard things. It's also a little bit showing our DNA, yeah. being an being a, um, a early adopter for new lifestyles, being um, always a little bit ahead of the design trend and so on. So and from the material, we stay to, to true materials and this is our DNA, like it is aluminum. If you see an aluminum surface, for example, this has to be a real aluminum. Yeah. So we cannot cheat on that. So if there is a glass, it needs to be a real glass. If there is concrete, it can't be just a printing. It has to be a real concrete. Yeah. Like you see also with our coffee machine, the, the wooden application, like the, the, the handle for the porter filter or the timber, this is real wood. This is oak, um, Canadian oak, by the way. Mm. And this is real, true materials. And this is our philosophy. Thomas, thank you very much for your time. It is appreciated. It was a pleasure. Thank you. Thank you so much. And that wraps up our coverage from here in Berlin. Some really interesting products and we'll be getting them through very soon for review. So stay tuned. Don't forget you can subscribe to the channel and if you've enjoyed the video, then please do give it a like and we'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.